I'm Lilius Jim. My, my name is um, William Mokay. Okay. Today, I'm going to read another part of the Bible. Um, it calls this. Today, I'm going to read 1 Samuel chapter 31. Okay, okay. And now the Philistines fought against Israel, and the men of Israel, and fled before the Philistines, and fell down and slain at Mount Gilboa. And the Philistines followed upon Saul and upon his sons, and, and, the, and the Philistines slew Jonathan, and Anemadab, and Mochishoa, Saul's sons. And the battle would soar against Saul. And the archers hit hit them hit him. He was sore and wounded of the archers. And then and, and said Saul, and unto his armor bearer, Draw thy sword and trust me through therewith. And this these uncircumcised come, thrust me through, abuse me, as armor bearer would not be would not for he was afraid. Therefore, so therefore, so took a word upon it. When his armor bearer saw that Saul was dead, he fell likewise with his sword and died with him. So Saul died in his three sons, and his armor bearer, and then men in the same day together. And the man, and when the men of Israel that were on the other side of the valley, and they were on the other side of Jordan, saw that the men of Israel fled, and that Saul and his sons were dead, and they were like the cities and fled, and the Philistines came and dwelt in them. And it came to pass on the morrow, when the Philistines came to strip the slain, and they found that Saul and his three sons had fallen in Mount Geboa, they fell off and they fell, and they cut off his head and stripped off his armor, and sent the land of the Philistines around about, and and to plumish it in the house of their idols, among the people. And they put his armor in the house of Estorith, and they fastened the body of the well of, of Bishan, and when they have had of Jibish, Gilead, and heard of that. Which, which the Philistines had done to Saul. All the valiant men arose and with the night and took at the body of Saul and the body of the sons of the, of the, from the wall of Bithshan, the king of Jebash, and Jebesh, and, and burnt them there. And when, they, and when they took the bones and buried them under the tree of, tree at Jebesh, and, fa and fasted seven days. Okay, it's ending of first unit chapter thirty one. Okay, so this means that I'm done reading the book of first Samuel. Next video I'll read the book of Second Samuel. Okay? So and I'll read it so and next video I'll read um Second Samuel chapter one. Okay? So I'll read 2nd Samuel chapter 1 next video. Okay, okay. I think we have to go right now. So thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoy it. And I'll see you there. Bye.